in. Okay, and share the screen again. Wow. Okay, so, uh, okay, just uh, before we talk about uninteresting, so let's talk about mine. I mean, let me say uh, actually a point here that is really important. Uh, well, about this one, if you describe an event, something that happened to you, or for example, experience as mind numbing, of course, you mean that is boring. Okay. But you know, boring at the same time, so bad, you know, or for example, it was yeah. really great. Okay. Like, you know, of course, you're talking about you know, negative effect inside of it. So you can think about it clearly, you know, so it can be the combination of so bad and boring, you know? So like, yeah. especially, yeah. For example, when you spend a mind numbing day, it's like awful, uh, totally can be awful day. Well, yeah. Okay. Uninteresting. 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 Yeah. Interesting. So, for example, you can say, I don't know. So you gave me some options. You offered me some options, but all of them are uninteresting. So I'm not interested in actually these options, okay, that you offered. So like this. Yeah. So can, yeah. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I found that work, work is not uninteresting at all, but we... Yeah. But we have to do it. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, just you know, it's okay. Just at all is used to uh, say, for example, in negative statement. So yeah. it's yeah. completely uninteresting. Completely. So, yeah. yeah, uninteresting. Yeah, of course. And you know, you can also use uninterested. So, for example, you know, I'm uninterested in what is going on around me. I am uninterested. I'm not interested in what's going on here. Just, you know, I don't care. So, uninterested about you, uninteresting something that makes you feel uninterested, okay? So, uninterested, interested. like, you know, negative form of interested. So, you are interested in something or you are not interested or uninterested in something. Yeah. Well, relaxing. Relaxing. But, okay, yeah. tell me about a relaxing thing in your life. So when you want to chill out, chill out means chill relax. Out. Chill out. Relax. Yeah. Yeah. What is relaxing? So music or a movie? B books no yeah. i know yeah. that you are yeah. not interested yeah of course you <laughs> you are not a big fan of books yeah i'm um, my relaxing time is uh is uh my relaxing my relaxing time is the uh, is the uh, drinking beer and uh, watching movies. Yeah. So you can say 
drinking, okay, drinking and watching drinking. movie is relaxing. So relaxing yeah. time, well, you don't thanks. need to translate word, but we're just, you know, yeah, drinking, okay, beer and, for example, watching TV is really mm -hmm. relaxing. Mm -hmm. So, Re yeah. yeah, relaxing, yeah. Yeah, very good. And recreational, so you can use recreational. this one, recreational facilities, for example. Yeah. Ah. Uh, there are not enough of recreational facilities in the uh, Ho Chi Minh City. Very good. Okay. And the next one, obsessive. 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 Let's So let me ask you a question. Uh, do yeah, young yeah. people, do young people in your country, especially young girls, are obsessive about their weight in your country? So, you know, they normally uh, actually have some, you know, are on really strict diets not to eat and not to yeah. drink, to <clears throat> lose weight. So they're obsessive <clears throat> about their weight, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Ah. Uh -huh. Says. Hmm. Okay. Ah, uh, there are. <clears throat> A lot of young people is obsess obsessive about uh, their appearance. Appearance, of course. Yeah, appearance. 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 Yeah. 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 Of course. Of course. So a lot of uh, youngsters okay. or young people who are who are wow. obsessive, of course, about their appearance. Yeah. And the last one, absorbing. So, absorbing. Absorbing. Mm. Absorbing. Oh. Okay, online games are absorbing. Yeah, of course they are. Yeah, gripping, yeah. captivating, of Very course. Yeah, yeah, of course. Well, okay, let's keep going. Ah, eat, sleep, and breathe. So, what is the meaning? So, first of all, before I explain the meaning of this, this idiom, eat, sleep, and breathe something, what it means, what can you guess? Mm. Eat, sleep, and breathe. Yeah, mm. eat, sleep, and breathe something, of course. Something, yeah. So, what it means, of course, so you eat, you sleep, you sleep, and you breathe. Something like, you know, you are really enthusiastic. You spend yeah. a lot of time. So incredibly enthusiastic about something. So incredibly enthusiastic about 
something. Or something. Yeah, if, uh, yeah, if, like yeah. to be very so we have to be very passionate and think about something constantly. So like you know. So he seems to eat, sleep, and breathe computer games. Games. What do you sleep, eat, and breathe with? Do you have? Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um when I was a student, I uh, uh hmm. sorry, how, how to say when the subject is uh I I. What? Subject? But okay. When I was when I was a student, yeah. I eat I was hmm? I I ate, I ate, I ate, I slept and yeah. Ah uh, okay. I ate, slept and brief. On uh, spot. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Really. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, and and specifically, what what spirits though? Oh, tennis, tennis. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Like, <laughs> so we have Chris. You know. You know. I'm into so because you know I really like you know, I'm into, a big fan of yeah. forest like you know so yeah so you ate you slept and you breathed I slept and breathed. tennis yeah it's you breathe tennis, in tennis yeah. when you were yeah yeah of course yeah and ah human sport subject PE you mean you want to see PE yeah. physical yeah. education yeah, yeah PE so if you mean the subject a PE physical education well okay so you don't play tennis anymore yeah <clears throat> yeah no 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 because uh, ah. uh, i don't have time and uh, i don't have uh friends ah, playing tennis course. in vietnam now yeah yeah of course yeah, but it's really good, you know. It's you know, tennis, I think, has everything like you know, active and yeah. you know, fun, and yeah. that is really good That's sport. Right. I really like it, yeah. I think, you know. But as you said, yeah, of course, you need a partner to play with, yeah, and you need yeah. time first, but it's really yeah. good. Well, and isolate yourself from something. Yeah, we discussed it. We explained it Excellent. before. So you know yeah. that, you know, uh, as we talked about before, like, you know, if you don't tend to do something, mm. be with others. So I'm so worried about my cousin to spend hours in his virtual world and seems to isolate himself from his family. Not to talk, not to leave the room. Yeah. So we so you can isolate yourself from someone or something someone. You know, something Thanks. like not someone you know, people normally yeah. of course and so for example you can use it when you uh, of course when you're having cold you need to isolate yourself from people so that yeah because it's catching so yeah. that all the people don't catch cold so yeah. isolate yourself from someone means actually to keep yourself for yourself. Like just, yeah, this, not to talk, not to leave, oh. not to be, not to socialize, nothing. Yeah. And finally be depressed. Well, <laughs> okay. So let's keep going. We have a uh, listening section listen to two people answering the questions and circle the correct answer well let me share the audio 
21. Unit 11. Recording 3. Robert. I think they have already changed the way we live. I mean, a lot of people like me spend a lot of time playing on computer games. Some people already spend more time in virtual worlds, like Second Life, than they do in the real world. And I'm one of them. I'm starting to use Second Life at work too. I have meetings with my colleagues in Second Life. So it's not just a game. I think people are starting to spend more and more time in virtual worlds, where you can live in a castle by the beach and look beautiful and fly, etc. It's more fun and exciting than the real world, where you have to worry about money. So, yes, it started as a kind of game, but I think it's really changing how we live, how we work and study, everything. Miriam. Well, they're not changing the way I live very much. I mean, they're just games like any other game. I quite like computer games, some of them. There are lots of games I don't like, like the violent games. But for me, it's just the same as the other things I do. I mean, sometimes I read a book or watch television to relax. Sometimes I go out for a walk and sometimes I play a computer game. It's not changing my life. I don't spend all my time on the computer. I use a computer for work, so I don't want to be on the computer all the time at home, too. And I think a lot of people are like me. In our free time, we prefer to do other things. Well, so Robert, so does he think computer games are changing the way we live? Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> yes. And hmm. does he use a computer for work? No. So what? So, why? Why does well, he use? Uh, she, I, no, yes, yes. She used uh, the computer for work. Yeah, of course. Well, let me check. So it's not really. Okay. okay. And how about Miriam? So does she think computer Miriam. games are changing? No. Yeah. And does yeah. she use a computer she... for work? Yes. Of course. And the last question, of course, not visible, so I can see it's not clear, so I can see the last word. Well, so we need to listen again and complete Robert Miriam's statement. So let's listen and complete, fill in the blanks again. Yeah. Unit 11, recording three. Robert. I think they have already changed the way we live. I mean, a lot of people like me spend a lot of time playing on computer games. Some people already spend more time in virtual worlds, like Second Life, than they do in the real world. And I'm one of them. I'm starting to use Second Life at work, too. I have meetings with my colleagues in Second Life. So it's not just a game. I think people are starting to spend more and more time in virtual worlds, where you can live in a castle by the beach and look beautiful and fly, etc. It's more fun and exciting than the real world, where you have to worry about money. So, yes, it started as a kind of game, but I think it's really changing how we live, how we work and study, everything. Miriam. Well, they're not changing the way I live very much. I mean, they're just games like any other game. I quite like computer games, some of them. There are lots of games I don't like, like the violent games. But for me, it's just the same as the other things I do. I mean, sometimes I read a book or watch television to relax. Sometimes I go out for a walk, and sometimes I play a computer game. It's not changing my life. I don't spend all my time on the computer. I use a computer for work, 
so I don't want to be on the computer all the time at home, too. And I think a lot of people are like me. In our free time, we prefer to do other things. Well, let's say number one, I think they have... have already changed the way yeah. we live. Yeah, and number two... Some people already spend more time in virtual worlds, like Second Life, than they do in the real world. Number three, I have meetings with my colleagues in uh, Second Life. Yeah, colleagues in Second Life. Right. So it's uh, more fun and exciting than the real world when you have to worry about money. Of course. And five, Miriam, there right. are lots. There are lots of games I don't like, like the survival games. Violent. Wild, ah, violent. violent. <laughs> survival <laughs> is good because good. <laughs> yeah, at least you survive, so it's like survival is good, but the violent. Yeah. And six? Yeah, violence, yes. Yeah. I don't spend all my time on the computer. And I think a lot of people are like me. Of course. In our free time, we prefer to do other things. Yeah, of course. Very good. Well, and now, so tell me, first of all, do you play computer games? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> so what uh, do you think of Sometimes. Yeah. Computer game. I said, when, when I have free, sometimes, just sometimes, I have yeah. uh, free time. I play uh, the game. It's the yeah, first. installed in the mobile phone. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You know, so I, I remember, yeah. so actually I, I used to have a students and I remember that she was addicted to computer games and she actually like, you know, just played computer games all okay. the whole night. And so yeah. and after that, so for morning, she couldn't open her eyes, just like, like you know, headache and something, but, you know, Every session I told her, okay, so just stop so you can rest. Okay, if you want to play, that's okay, perfect. So you can play during the day. And she said, no, I need to go to work. So because of this, yeah. I, I need to play during the night. So it's like, no. I think it's really scary, the time yeah. consuming. And, you know, as you can see, there are some uh, negative side, like addict they are addictive. They are time consuming. Something. So you spend a lot Something. of time and they may harm your eyes. So they're yeah. harmful, of course. Well, and next one, why do you think many young people enjoy playing computer games? So because they're entertaining, fun, and because they help young people escape from people their escape boring from life. Their boring life. <laughs> I don't feel a sense of winning. Mm. 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 Ah, okay. Basically, I think a uh, video game are enter entertaining. It's uh, yes. yeah, interesting. Of course they are captivating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. really. <laughs> of course they are. <laughs> yeah, of course. Well, and about this one, maybe we don't know because we don't play. Sense. But yeah. maybe make them feel maybe. the sense of winning. Actually, yeah. you know, maybe they can't, they feel like they can't be a winner in real life. So why yeah. not? Okay. They yeah. rely on a virtual world. So. Okay. So let's talk about these opinions. So number one, to say if you agree or not. So 
I play computer games all the time. They don't make you violent in real life. What do you think? Do you agree? They don't make you violent. Don't mm. make violent in real life. Mm. It don't make you violent in real life. Yes, maybe. Correct. But I think they make. <laughs> yeah. But I, I really, you know, I just think about children. Oh. How angry yeah. they are. You know, uh, how angry they are in real life. For example, you know, students, because we have, you know, I have some students, yeah. some children, you know, they are really angry. They become really quickly angry with yeah. everything. Just, you know, mm -hmm. and they mm -hmm. actually are really reactive. They have really severe reactions. Like, okay, so why? It's not really important. So, and when we talk to the parents, unfortunately, they spend a lot of time on phone and playing video games. Yeah. So they make. Yeah, for children. Yeah, for children. Yeah. Well, and the last question. So computer games make you feel better. If I'm uh, angry, I shoot lots of. Lot of. Yeah, this one, <laughs> this one uh, really uh, okay. aliens in a game. It doesn't hurt anyone. Doesn't hurt anyone. <laughs> so yeah. of course. May you're... maybe maybe. Yeah, of yeah. course. <laughs> we we can see uh, the same scene in yeah. movies. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> Of course, yes. Yeah. So, for example, you are angry with your, yes. I don't know, wife or husband, then you can play a game yes, and yes. you can use yeah. <laughs> so that you, you become, yes. you say, yes, okay, yes. Yeah. <laughs> that's okay now. Well, of course, but, uh, you know, that's really interesting because, you know, the last thing of the session, so according to research, computer games can boost and increase actually the level of your uh something like brain and intelligence yeah. so they make you smarter at the same time they can be really dangerous so that's really interesting yeah. because you know yeah i watched a video related to this topic well okay and that's it so again yeah it's time to go and we talked yeah. this topic in detail so thank you so much yeah. And it was thank really you, good to much. see you and have a great night. Yeah, yeah thank you. Thank you You're very welcome. much. You're welcome. You're yeah. welcome. Goodbye. I'll see you. Goodbye. See you. Bye bye. See you. Bye. bye.